right friends welcome back to fifth week questions and answers 2016 this is first february to seventh february let us look at the first question microcephaly is the disease affecting brain and around 4200 children were born with microcephaly in brazil and this is due to zika virus zika virus is spread through aids mosquito and this was first found in monkeys in zika forest in uganda and zika is the name of forest and at the same time please don't forget ebola is the name of river name the states which allowed most educated girls in the villages to hoist national flag on republic day so as to promote education of girl child and in tune with the spirit of beti bachao beti padao two states haryana and gujarat allowed most educated girls in the villages to hoist a national flag on republic day and please don't forget in haryana girl child below 1 year age were invited to attend the republic day celebrations under mera pehla ganatantra divas basically with a view to give prominence to beti bachao beti padao because of the skewed sex ratio in this country the vice president is on a five day visit to brunei darussalam and thailand these two are the southeast asian countries and the capital of brunei darussalam is bandar seri bhagwan please don't forget and all of you are well aware thailand's capital is bangkok in t20 series india defeated australia by 3-0 and the man of the series has gone to virat kohli after 4-1 drubbing in one day series india salvaged the pride by defeating australia by 3-0 world's number 1 novak djokovic retained the australian open men's singles title and don't forget he retained it for the sixth time and he defeated andy murray of britain this is his total 11th grand slam title this is djokovic's 11th grand slam title and at the same time 6th australian open singles title zika virus became a major public health hazard in latin american countries as per the world health organization estimates it has already spread to around 26 countries a case was also reported in china united states of america and several european countries are also reporting one or two other cases and if you ask where is latin america please look into it the countries below united states of america in both north and south america are categorized as latin american countries kesri kant clinched the men's singles title of sayed modi international grand prix gold badminton championship and this was held at lucknow and women's title was backed by sang ji hyun of south korea beti bachao beti padao is being implemented in 100 districts and this was launched on january 22 2015 by the prime minister at panipat in haryana in 100 districts which include 12 districts of haryana haryana because of its skewed sex ratio assumed a lot of significance in this program beti bachao and beti padao and it will be extended to another 61 districts and please don't forget last year this was implemented in 100 districts and this beti bachao beti padao will be implemented in further 61 districts which of the following completed 10 years of its operation on february 2 this is the most important program of mahatma gandhi narega and this was started on february 2 2006 by the then prime minister and it completed 10 years and as per this mahatma gandhi narega all the rural population of above 18 years age have got right to employment in rural areas for minimum of 100 days and in recent times lot of dilution took place in this program Syria peace talks were started in Geneva and abandoned subsequently Syria is into crisis because of civil war and almost 2 and a half lakh to 3 lakh people were lost their lives 
during the past 5 years due to civil war name the wicket keeper batsman who scored the fastest 50 in under 19 world cup history it is rishabh pant who scored 50 in just 18 balls when he played against nepal and overall he scored 78 in 24 balls and please don't forget indian skipper in under 19 cricket tournament is ishan kishan the prime minister inaugurated vision conclave of third global ayurveda meet at kozhikod in kerala and at global ayurveda meet bgr 34 first ayurveda medicine for diabetic was also released and prime minister visited the two states kerala and tamil nadu and in tamil nadu the prime minister inaugurated the building of esic medical college and hospital in coimbatore right look into the next one two day counter terrorism conference was inaugurated by the president at jaipur and here the keynote address was given by ceo of afghanistan abdullah abdullah ceo and head of council of ministers is abdullah abdullah for afghanistan he visited india recently and he gave keynote address at counter terrorism conference at jaipur and theme for this counter terrorism conference is tackling global terror outfits and at the same time please don't forget jaipur also hosted regional editors conference name the state where saru sajai sports complex is situated that is in assam this is a famous sports complex of football and athletics and this is also known as indira gandhi stadium please don't forget 12th south asian games were opened by the prime minister at this indira gandhi stadium or saru sajai sports complex in gauhati and at the same time please don't forget this south asian games are being held or hosted by two states assam and meghalaya that is gauhati and shillong and at the same time eminent artist nuruddin ahmed designed 113 species of birds and animals right friends look into the next one legendary urdu fiction writer intizar hussain died in pakistan he was originally born in bulandshahar district of uttar pradesh and migrated to pakistan at the time of partition in 1947 and he died at lahore at the age of 93 and he got the prestigious award of france in 2014 the award name was officer of the order of arts and letters look into the next one name the state government which announced baba saheb ambedkar special group incentive scheme for dalit entrepreneurs this group incentive scheme for dalit entrepreneurs was started by maharashtra government name the state government which decided to extend cheap meal scheme ahar to 29 districts this cheap meal scheme of giving rice and dalma for rupees 5 is already under implementation in five cities and now it will be extended to 29 districts the state we are talking about is odisha Name the Indian who has been appointed as head of mission and force commander of the United Nations Disengagement Observer Force. For this United Nations Disengagement Observer Force, or popularly known as UNDOF, Major General Jay Shankar Menon was appointed. Name the state which won the 61st National School Athletics Championship, and This national school athletics championships, 61st one, were held in Kerala, Kozhikode in Kerala, and please don't forget for the 19th consecutive time, Kerala became the champions. Kerala won this championship for 19th consecutive time, and for this year, Tamil Nadu and Maharashtra stood in second and third positions. Name the company which replaced Apple. 
to become the world's most valuable firm based on the value of shares with the better than expected earnings the company we are talking about is alphabet that is the parent company of google and it replaced apple to become the most valuable firm in the world under smart cities mission state government and center will spend rupees 500 crore each for each city during the next 4 years central government will give rupees 200 crores this year followed by 100 crores each during the next 3 years which makes 500 crores state government will also give 500 crores that means a total 1000 crores will be given by center and the states put together 13th edition of auto expo was held at greater noida this year's focus is on electric and hybrid vehicles greater noida is near delhi but it is a part of uttar pradesh state please don't forget make in india week program will be held at mumbai and government wants to make it a big event this is make in india week in mumbai from 13th to 18th of february paramparagat krishi vikas yojana is basically to promote organic farming india wants to make entire country open defecation free by 2nd october 2019 when we are going to celebrate 150th birth anniversary of mahatma gandhi by that date entire india should be open defecation free that means nobody should go outside for attending nature's call and in this connection two states have already been declared as open defecation free they are kerala in south india and sikkim in northeast if someone asks you what are the states which were declared as open defecation free please don't forget kerala and sikkim name the person who was appointed vice president and chief investment officer of aiib he is a dj pandian this AIIB will have five vice presidents and one of the vice president will be DJ Pandian and he will be responsible for investments so he is a chief investment officer and he was former chief secretary of Gujarat and as he is being appointed as chief investment officer of Asian Infrastructure Investment Bank then we can expect more funds flow to our country One of the biggest deals in history Trans-Pacific Partnership was signed in Auckland of New Zealand and this Trans-Pacific Partnership is a grouping of 12 countries so as to have free trade and these TPP countries constitute around 40% of global economy please don't forget name the bank which offered home loan product with the flexible EMIs that is the state bank of india here borrowers can get a moratorium on principal repayment for 3 to 5 years moratorium means they need not pay that is you can say holiday of paying back the loan and it has got several flexible options the bank we are talking about is state bank of india name the car company which decided to change the name of the car in view of the zika virus It is a Tata Motors they want to rename the car which was initially planned as Jika right in view of the virus threat they want to change the name of the car which of the following launched its own repository that is life insurance corporation of india so life insurance corporation of india will maintain its own database and 24/7 basis customers can have access to the details of their policy bonus and other details and loans and claims will be available to customers registered through this portal anupam verma committee is to review the continued use of pesticides and look at the next question 12th south asian games were inaugurated by the prime minister at guwahati i have already told you guwahati and shillong are hosting this 11 day event and eight sark countries are participating and 2500 athletes are participating from eight sark nations first time this was held in kolkata in 1987 
and the previous games that means 11th south asian games were held in dhaka and flag bearer for indian contingent is squash player gaurav goshal and total 23 sports disciplines will be there and 228 events will be held please don't forget international fleet review 2016 was held at visakhapatnam all of you are well aware and the first international fleet review in india was held in bombay in 2001 and in this connection maritime exhibition popularly known as the marex was also inaugurated name the country which celebrated 68th independence day on february 4 the country we are talking about is sri lanka and incidentally world cancer day also falls on february 4th please don't forget prime minister inaugurated brahmaputra cracker and polymer limited at the lepet taka and this is the petrochemical unit situated in assam prime minister visited assam and this is situated in dibrugarh district of assam and at the same time prime minister also inaugurated wax plant of nimaligar refineries limited and prime minister also became the first to participate in the annual conference of shrimanta shankar dev sangha at rupoli pahar in shivsagar district in its 85 year history president delivered 54th convocation address of iari iari is situated in delhi indian agricultural research institute but initially it was established in Pusa in Bihar and subsequently it got shifted to New Delhi. Look at the next one. IOCL's largest oil refinery was dedicated to the nation at Paradeep by the Prime Minister. And this is the largest refinery of Indian Oil Corporation Limited set up with an investment of around 34,000 crores of rupees. Capacity is 15 million metric tons per annum. and with this the total capacity of iocl has gone to 81 million metric tons per annum and the foundation stone was led by atal bihari vajpayee in 2000 it took 15 to 16 years but finally the largest refinery plant of indian oil corporation was inaugurated by the prime minister government deferred the decision to allow genetically modified mustard there are views and counter views under the circumstances the genetically modified mustard introduction is postponed union external affairs minister inaugurated the race of digital india exhibition in colombo and this is a part of six month long festival of india celebrations in sri lanka and our external affairs minister participated in 9th india sri lanka joint commission meeting in colombo our external affairs minister visited colombo and while on her visit to colombo she inaugurated race of digital india exhibition in colombo 9th indo nepal combined battalion level military training exercises surya kiran were held at pithodagar in uttarakhand and these are held twice in a year alternatively in the nepal and india and this uh, surya kiran these are combined military training exercises between india and nepal recently they were held in pethodgar in uttarakhand and please don't forget if someone says surya kiran these are the joint level exercises between india and nepal ncs was launched in 2015 to provide employment services to the public ncs stands for national career service and it is a it based platform for providing employment the government recently stated enrollments under pradhan mantri kaushal vikas yojana crossed 10 lakh mark and please don't forget pm kvy stands for pradhan mantri kaushal vikas yojana basically for skill development Union Minister for Health and Family Welfare Jagat Prakash Nadda launched Project Sunlight. This is the project for prevention of AIDS in northeastern states and it will be implemented in 20 districts of 8 states of northeast and it was launched in Imphal in Manipur. Name the presidential act 
which sailed past more than 70 ships as part of international fleet review that is INS Sumitra. Boarding INS Sumitra, President, the Supreme Commander of Armed Forces will take a salute from other ships. So, if someone asks what is the name of a presidential act that is INS Sumitra. Sudhir Thailang, the famous cartoonist passed away recently and he got Padma Shri award in 2004. He died at relatively young age of 56 years. The tagline for International Fleet Review 2016 is United Through Oceans. Please don't forget. DJ Pandian was appointed as one of the vice presidents of AIIB we have just now discussed and he will be chief investment officer responsible for investments. Which of the following crop is approved for getting the GI tag in 2016? Basmati rice. Basmati rice grown in certain states, especially Jammu and Kathwa districts of Jammu and Kashmir, then some districts of Himachal, Uttarakhand, Western Uttar Pradesh, Punjab and Haryana, in that northwestern belt, basically in the foothills of Himalayas, the rice grown, that is Pasmati rice, will get geographical indication tag, just like Darjeeling tea, just like Kanchipuram saris, just like Nagpur oranges. So, once it gets a GI tag, its quality can be attributed to place of its origin. Two-day Global Biotechnology Summit Destination India was held in New Delhi and India wants to achieve $100 billion in biotechnology sector by 2020. Look at the last one. Name the firm which announced breakthrough in developing the world's first Zika vaccine that is Bharat Biotech, a Hyderabad based company has recently stated that it submitted to the government two vaccines pertaining to Zika virus. If it passes through the regulatory framework and clinical trials, then India can claim to have developed this vaccine. Right friends, with this let us conclude questions and answers for fifth week. Please do join for other modules. Have a nice day. Thank you.